Hello, I'm Andrew Lewis and welcome back to Airships Conquer the Skies, where we have some airships and we'll be conquering the skies. Actually, this episode we're probably going to build a land ship, because we want to make a large siege engine capable of firing a lot of torpedoes. We're unlocking torpedoes right now. Once that is done, we're going to be good. Now, Sado can't really invade anywhere particularly poignant. Um, try invading one of the things over here. Yeah, you're totally easy to invade. I'm, up, I'm in, I'm in. Tell you to board. Oh, ow! That was a lucky hit. Oh, God damn it. Keep moving! Thank you. Oh, whoa! Alright, all board. Okay. Now run. Oh, oh god, the front of the ship is badly damaged. Captured, though. Now, some of suggested we could go for pillaging, uh, resulting in a lot of money in the short term, but reduces their long-term income. Now, I'm actually getting quite a lot of long-term income from a lot of the things over here. However, it might be a good idea here, because that means that once they retake it, it won't really matter, because they, they'll have less income, because it'll have damaged the permanent income of it. Oh, uh, yeah, that we can definitely get. Okay, everyone get ready. Uh-oh, that sounds like thunder. Do the thing! Now that was efficient. I approve. Pillaging. Straight up, same again. Oh, only captured it uh, with only half the people. That's impressive. Pillage. I'm surprised they don't have any ground forces or air units anywhere. They've got some over here, I guess. You're going to be harder to take. I think we can manage it. I'm going to start off way at the back. We're going to need to fly in and out. So I've told them to board. Then we just sprint in, and then we're going to sprint out. Here is the job. Quick in, quick out. Okay. Gently does it. We're going to be able to be shot up by these if we go there, actually. <sighs> yeah, if you go here, they have a backwards arc. Flamethrower! Oh god! The boarding has begun. Okay, yeah, we definitely need to go now. Go, 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 go. Uh. 
Okay, our troops are inside. I think we might fail on this one. That's pretty well defended. Okay, uh, we failed. Let's flee. <sighs> Damn. Guess we'll invade over here. Ooh, aerial torpedo. Now, we can go for reduced torpedo minimum range or extra damage. I'm not sure what I want yet. Obviously, with Siege Engine, you don't need the minimum range as much. Uh, I think in the meantime, we'll try and grab... Massive stone walls is a good one. Oh, we don't have that unlocked. Do we have this unlocked? Oh, no, we need this. We need uh, tracks to be able to put our torpedoes on. Now we will try and do that really quick. Uh, no, we're going to flee. I'm not facing that. Obviously, that used to be a different nation. And there we go. Look at that income just getting crushed. Right, here we go. You can stop shooting it. There we go. Pause. And fade. Oh, they surrendered. They're legit. They've got a rocket firing at the back, so this is going to be a quick in and out again. Oh, that rocket's good. Oh, close. This rocket is very close. Oh, it. Oh, we got hit twice there. Okay, well, we can leave now. Bye bye. I think I will go for the gentle takeover. We've given them enough to be worried about now. Another one. This is the long term income. Ooh, upwards firing gun. Uh, it does have a rifle. That means it will be able to shoot down some of my people who come for it. So we'll probably do the whole drop someone in. Directly on top of it. Okay, and it is ours. Done. Gentle takeover. Pirates, I don't know how powerful they are. Village that belongs to someone without a city. It's like taking candy from a baby. Which is apparently very hard. Like, babies really like that candy. Channel takeover. Um, we'll try and take this. Oh, we can take this. We'll get shot at a lot, so there will be a danger here because we've got a lot of rifles. But in theory, we can take this. All right, borders.
Okay. Boarding action done. Live. There we go. Took a while on that one. Uh, we will do a pillaging takeover here because you're probably going to try and take it back. But damn, we've we've kicked some ass there. I'm trying to invade up here. See what we can get. While we wait for the siege engine, we're just going to build a couple more Calicas. We'll build three more. Okay. Fjordan, what do you have to offer? Another one of these. I'm actually just going to hold before going in closer. Get them ready. Now go. Right. Jump, 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 jump. And just go straight up. Get a range of the cannons. There we go. Um, we'll pillage this one. Again, it's going to be one of these close ones. I know they're like a starting tier thing made of wood, but they offer us some threat. We captured this? No, we didn't. Oh, okay. Oh, nope. Uh, did not mean to do that. That's definitely uh, flea time. Yep. Okay, we'll try again over here. Whoa! Oh, they hit the suspendium chamber. Oh, well, that puts paid to the uh, HMS Parker. Until we build another two. They performed really well, okay. Hell, build three. And we now have ourselves some tracks. Uh, we'll build armor. And then over here, that's a small shipyard. This is a small shipyard as well. That sucks. Medium shipyard. Ah. Design land ship. Pull up name list. And this is the hall. So this is going to be the... Her Majesty's vehicle, HMV, hall. Tracks. Do a bigger track? Oh, we do. Awesome. Large track. That might be a little bit big. My pledge was to like start using smaller vehicles. She's just quite expensive. Uh, 
ammo store. Gap between those so they don't catch on fire. Maybe another ammo store. And a fire point. Something like that. And then torpedo. Oh, and telescope. Any way to get that extra accuracy bonus. Torpedo, 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 torpedo. That's a whole lot of torpedoes already. And look at that price. Whoa. Yeah, 208 per torpedo. What? What? Why does it change? Oh, maybe I'm hitting E by mistake, I think. Okay. Uh, oh, I flipped it. Whoops. There we go. F. Solves that problem. What's our weight like? Weight is okay. Armor, you will be... 3-6. You mm. have more HP, sure. Reinforced wood armor for all. Exceeds the weight limit. Okay. What if we shaved a bit of weight? I, sw I swear I hit the right key there. I guess we can have two tracks. The issue, of course, is I don't want this entrance going into here, because if that blows up, we can't then get into the track. Maybe. The time is to remove that bottom torpedo. Look at that cost. I guess it is a siege engine, right? Uh, maybe for looks, I'll keep them a little bit separate. Wow, they need to be really separate. Oh, well. That time I definitely press the right key. Sometimes D is changing it to decoration. Which is very strange. I mean, I understand D for decoration, but that's not how this should work. Uh... What else do we want? Like, we could put a dorsal turret on, but that would mean that we couldn't use the crow's nest. Also, you're going to rely 100% on other people to defend you. I'm, I'm okay with that. That's fine. Marine barracks. Yeah, it'd be cheaper to use the guard barracks. And it has a ladder involved, which is 100% what I want from this. Uh, repair bay. Seems a good call. So we're going to get shot at a lot. Bridge. We probably need a cockpit. We probably don't need to go over the top with this. We'll put the cockpit here for the moment. I'll change that later. I 
I want to use the normal bunks. Ooh, fire extinguisher. That's useful. I might have a second ladder running through here. Just because if one of these gets taken out, we then can't get to these to fill them with stuff. Ah, well, we'll see. We'll see. Where's the whole troop thing? Not troop. Birth. Ah, that's it. Birth. I saw the birth. Where is it? Come on. There we go. So that's our route up. Where's keel? Can we get like a small keel in? Ooh, that keel fits really nicely. And we've already got a telescope actually at the bottom, so we don't need that. Ah, that exceeds our weight though. I definitely pressed E there. Okay, maybe it's just me pressing E. Where's the people thing? Quarters. And then we'll put the cockpit here. We'll have to get rid of this keel, weighs too much. And then, what do I put in the gap here? I guess skirt we can put an extra torpedo in. What do we need? More people. Supply. I'm actually going to change this up. We want the cockpit to be lower so that it can't be invaded through the crow's nest, because that happened in a previous episode. And then we'll put our supply hatches up here. Steel supply hatch. And we still need more crew. Or we could go for birth to get that extra ladder in. I don't even need these guards. Yeah, let's try and swim down. I haven't seen anyone using boarding against me, so we'll try and swim down. We're going to need births there so they can use the ladder. Um, there we go. And I guess we could just use like a basic corridor here just to fill this out. Crow's nest. <sighs> My only concern is we might not have enough ammo. And it is quite expensive. But whatever, we'll make it work. Okay. With that...
Trying to think how to best make this look badass. Probably if we raise that one. Put an extra bunk in, just because we can. And then... Use a... Four long flat. Uh, we'll want a four long vertical. And then probably like a curved blob at the back. And here we could put, I don't know, something just random. The weight is too much. Really? It's the prettiness bits that make this way too much. You're joking. But these are just prettiness. I... It frustrates me so much that that's a thing in this, like, the prettiness blocks. I guess they have HP. And then just paint it. Empire colors. Decoration. Huge. I want to see those like gun ports and stuff. There. And then, uh. Not a large steel nameplate, just a normal steel nameplate. Definitely missing something up the top here. Ah, I know what's missing. Medium flag. And then pennant. I can't delete that flag. Why not? Oh well, it's in now. And we'll save. We need a little bit of money to build this, but save, design, save, leave. We'll just wait to get the money. Build. Oh, one. one. Uh, build land ship. And we will delete the previous designs. Someone said I could just uh, put them in a folder or something. I can't be asked. I could do that, though. You're right. Uh, can I delete you? Oh, I guess I can't delete you from this menu. Well, we'll build a hole and we'll do that next time. Hi, are you coming to invade? You are. We do have two of us. Go to accurate five now. Doubles our accuracy. We're going to need it. We really are going to need it. Thank you for not attacking me, by the way. That's great. Really is helping. If they get behind me, we don't have any guns firing backwards, do we? Nope. We're doomed. Oh, we injured a load of people. Oh, 
Oh, better. Oh, good hits. Oh, suspend him exploded. There we go. We really aren't leaving much of that, are we? Okay, you want to just surrender already? Yeah, really, you should surrender. This is getting embarrassing. <laughs> now you surrender. Oh, yes. Well, we'll try and fight you. I doubt this is going to go exactly my way. Uh, good shots. Good shots. Come on, one more rocket. Ah. There we go. Yeah. Yeah, you, uh, you proved your point there. Okay, come on, build the HMV hall. Ooh, new armor. Which means the hall's armor is kind of out of date already. Massive stone walls. Make our fortifications better. Okay, you're going to try and take this back. Enemies appear in numbers. They do. Enemy superior numbers? What? Where is that superior number? They literally have one. And we've got one. I don't understand the superior number stuff. Also, why are we not under command? Is lightning injuring us? Is it lightning? Wow, that's unfair. The AI might need a bit of work. This is getting a bit familiar. I would tend to be more accurate, but I can't, so. Oh, well. <laughs> You're well armored. I'll give you that much. Screw it, you win. We just don't care enough. And we have the hall. Okay, we're going to get everyone to meet up there for the invasion. Uh, what's your defenses like? Hmm, we might be able to do some boarding here. Yeah? We do have a parker. Yeah, I'm in. Massive stone walls. High pressure suspendium dust. Sure. Right. This might be overkill. The point here is going to be 100% to defend the hall. So to do that, we're going to have a staggered line of Kerlikers. 
The reason I'm stagging them is so they don't crash on each other if they get shot down. I would like to capture you. That Gatling cannon is going to hurt a lot. Okay. Invasion done. Back away. We'll send you to the reserve. Captured. Awesome. In which case... If we've got bombs. Why are you not moving? There we go. Oh, are you dead? No. Oh, sweet. Uh, we'll send you to the reserve. You are very slow. Wow. Okay, we're going to move you away. The intention of letting you live and send you to the reserves. Oh, you're moving faster now. The swarm is here. We'll get you to be on accurate fire because you stand around of ammo. We captured it and it acted like a battering ram. That's fine by me. Oh god, that's a lot of stuff. Well, that worked. Oh, one Calica down. I'm going to move you all back. You're out of ammo. At least most of you are. Come on, torpedo. Ah! I guess we need to be close to the torpedoes. That sucks. Or of the targeting computer unlocked. Yeah, torpedoes really aren't getting close enough. You're going to need to move. Wait, are you all out of ammo? Okay, we flee. We lost a fair few calicas. And we'll have to invade again next time. Mm, yeah, we'll do it this time. They're, they're injured, they're on the run. Yeah, we'll have you at the front. Uh, we will make sure that you... Uh, we'll move you forwards when we start. Okay, so you move forwards to here. You move forwards to here. And you, we're going to go for an invasion. Okay, torpedoes are away. 
That looks a lot more accurate. Oh, much better. Please jump on board. Why are you jumping on that one? I told you to invade this one. That's not working. Running time. Thankfully, the torpedoes are really helping. And the Calicas do good work as well. I'm trolling aiming because of the light. That makes sense. Torpedoes away! I don't understand why some of them move a lot faster than others, but okay. Oh, nice explosions! Really just want to get rid of that dorsal turret, though. There. Did you run out of ammo? You did. Okay. Next iteration of the haul will probably want to increase the ammo supply. Uh, double. It needs double. Straight up. No question. It just needs it. Uh, we will do a gentle takeover. Because we are nice people. And we're going to need to repair oh so many of our ships. Uh, oh. I thought it was going to be the last fight, but no. Apparently, we're going to have this. Which is interesting. What are you? Hmm. Weird. That's what you are. And they're not moving. But they are able to fire us. Again, just going to accelerate time on this one. Just because it's a... I can't really do much scenario. Oh, are they boarding? No. They're boarding and flamethrowering. Focus on you if you can. Ammo's nearly gone. Oh, and uh, yep, there we go. An uncontested defeat. Okay, this is shaping up interestingly. Yeah, you uh, definitely deserve a cold heart. Actually, we'll probably want to do that next episode because we want to change the cold heart over to using our better armor. Yeah. Okay, for now, I've been Erosium. Until next time, like, subscribe, and stay shiny.